Kuznets curve. The Kuznets curve is a hypothetical curve that graphs economic inequality against income per capita. In the 1950s and 1960s, Simon Kuznets hypothesized that as an economy develops, market forces first increase then decrease the overall economic inequality of the society, which is illustrated by the inverted U shape of the Kuznets curve. According to the theory in the early development of an economy, new investment opportunities increase for those who already have the capital to invest. This means that those who already hold the wealth have the opportunity to increase that wealth. There is also an influx of inexpensive rural labor to the cities, which keeps wages down for the working class because labor supply is more, thus widening the income gap and escalating economic inequality. The Kuznets curve implies that as a society industrializes, the center of the economy shifts from rural areas to the cities. And rural laborers, such as farmers, begin to migrate seeking better paying jobs. This migration, however, results in a large rural urban income gap and rural populations decrease as urban populations increase. This economic inequality is expected to decrease when a certain level of average income is reached. It is at this point in economic development that society is meant to benefit from trickle-down effect and an increase in per capita income that effectively decreases economic inequality. The inverted U shape of Kuznets curve illustrates the basic elements of the Kuznets hypothesis, with income per capita graphed on the horizontal x-axis and economic inequality on the vertical y-axis. The graph shows that income inequality first increases, and then decrease after hitting a peak point as per capita income increases over the course of economic development. So this was a brief video on the Kuznets curve that shows a relation between economic inequality and economic growth with an inverted U-shaped curve. Hope this video was helpful to you. Do like the video and subscribe the channel if you have not yet. Thank you.